Welcome back. A lot of things have been happening within the South African political space, but we have our political analyst to break everything down to us. Welcome, Mr. Chester Missing, in studio today. Well, Louis, so I've got to say it's an honor to be back. It really is. And your eyebrows are looking so good, man, like two fluffy models that Kenny Koneni could eat sushi off. Thank you. Are you just are you sucking up to me now? You're no, sucking up to me. No, no, seriously, you, I'm just the missing. I don't behind. suck up to anybody. This is ridiculous. You no. know that you know that if you're not nice to me, I'm gonna send you back to that suitcase of yours. Ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. You see what I'm saying, people? If that suitcase was any smaller, comrade, the ANC would turn it into an RDP house. That's 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 crazy. That's crazy. But that's where we should keep you though. Suitcase. Which is also no, an RDP house. Suitcase is where you belong. Don't push me. Don't suitcase. push me, comrade. Suitcase. Don't push me. It's a matter of time before I start throwing poo. It's a matter of time. I heard that Helen Zilla will be making a, poo mo a movie about poo throwing with Leon Schuster. It'll be called There's a Poop on My Stoop. Or we can even call it There's a Feces on My Feces. Hala, hala, yeah, that's funny, man. You should get a TV show Thank or something. You. Thank you. I'm working on it. Yeah, I heard. I heard. Did you see that it was snowing on Table Mountain? Did you see that? I mean, it's a matter I, of time before someone accuses the DA of trying to make the mountain white. Mr. Mr. Uh, Mr. Bissing, we know you as a clever analyst. Uh, can you can we keep it to the clever stuff? What? Vavi. Okay, let's, Vavi, okay, okay, Rampe Vavi, Vavi. I mean, what does I say? Let's talk about those things. Keep it clever, well, Mr. Missing. I'm trying, guy, but I don't know what to start. I mean, I want to say about Vavi. He had inappropriate sex, rape charges, and then he got fired. He's on track to being the president, this guy. So are you saying there's a, there's a, there's trouble within the alliance? I mean, they won't pay for the Marikana victims' lawyers. I mean, how do you investigate atrocities against poor people in a commission that requires them to pay money to be involved? I mean, that's like having a safe sex conference in a brothel. I, I, I agree with you. Yes, I agree. We have two economies and that needs to change, Mr. Missing. I exactly, totally agree with you. Exactly, comrade, exactly. They should just call that TV show top billing what it actually is. You will never have. But I mean, you... now we hear that Dr. Rampele has 55 million. I mean, on the bright side, it's like she's her own Gupta. She's her own Gupta. That's yeah, funny. Yeah, it's I like that. Do you think uh, she stands a chance at the next year's elections? Well, to be honest, the only way I can see a Khan getting the youth vote is if they change their name to Man United. I mean, seriously. Mr. Missing, you know nothing about sport. You are a puppet, so let's keep... Yeah, okay, okay. Yes. I know, I know, I know, but I still know who our biggest player is. That I'll tell you. Who is our biggest player, Mr. Missing? Jacob Gedegekisa Zuma, that's who. The president's lawyer says they're not actually stalling over handing over the spy tapes. I mean, with that kind of spin, this guy could be playing for the Proteus. Another, another sports reference. Yeah, no sports. And, EFF, and EFF, they've kicked out Kenny Koneni. It's like Kenny did 67 minutes economic freedom fighting for Mandela. Uh, I think he's hoping to pursue a career as an open letter writer myself. The EFF even criticized Dr. Rampelli. Did you see that? For revealing her wealth. But I mean, I guess, I guess they would criticize that because their guy still has to explain where he got his 16 million rand tax bill. Boom! In your face! It, down! <laughs> in many people's faces. Yeah. But listen, listen, including mine, in my eyes, right? What I'm trying to get to is that with Vavi out, do you think there's trouble within the alliance then? Oh, it's hard to tell, Gola. I mean, it's likely I will be the new general secretary of Kasatu. Puppets are central members of the Zuma alliance, as we all know. Okay, if you were the leader of God, that's actually, that's, that's clever and low. And yeah, like, it is low. I like I know, that. I know. I like that. I know, but, it's like me. I'm sure. Okay, if you're I'm the, like, okay, sort of okay, okay. People low. like to talk. People like to talk. If you're the leader of Kasatu, what would you do? Well, I mean, I would put Tony and Gany in charge of the union because uh, he is our best drunk driver by far. Well, Mr. Missing, drunk driving is not something to be uh, proud of. Exactly, except in the tripartite alliance. In the tripartite alliance, drunk driving qualifies you to be a judge, health minister, or ANC spokesperson. That was Mr. Chester Missing, our political analyst, breaking it down for us. Now it's time for Deep Fried Man, who's hanging out with the muffins. News that moves. ENCA.com.